Alright guys, Blender Defender here with another quick tip tutorial and in this one I will show you a handy shortcut when you are dealing with many many keyframes. Blender Defender. Alright, so I have this animation of um, Suzanne exploding into, well, many little cubes here. And I've baked that down to keyframes. Um, but this is not what I want to do. Instead, I want to have to uh, to have this animation go backwards to have an effect like there are many cubes floating up randomly and they are all coming together as Suzanne in the end. And for this task, I want to flip these keyframes. So I could um, just take this first one, take it to the end, then take that one and exchange those two keyframes. But that would take way too long. So instead, I use a shortcut and for this one I will turn on screencast keys um, to do that autom automatically. So I select all these keyframes and I move my playhead to the end here and I press Ctrl M. This will bring up this pop-up dialog, which says mirror keys. And I select by times over current frame. So it will mirror all these keyframes along frame 80. So all I have to do now is take this and move it to the first frame. Et voila, I have a an animation of cubes floating around and coming together as the Suzanne the monkey. All right, I hope this little shortcut is helpful uh, for you. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And I hope this video got online early enough on the last Saturday of July because for this one I'm going to rely on the auto publish feature of YouTube. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments if this um, video got online uh, at the right time. And also, I just wanted to let you know that there was an update for my add-on Blender Analytics. Um, it's available on Gumroad for free or you can donate on Blender Market. And until next month, goodbye and always remember, a river cuts its way through stone not because it's so strong, but because it persistently pursues its destination.